Today's What's Inside Wednesday is in Herman and Augusta Schlegelmilk's house. They built this home in 1871, and this new wing was added in 1906. Uh, family members lived in the house until 1977 when the home was turned over to the Chippewa Valley Museum. This house is available for meetings and event rental at any time. So what might be behind this door is the master bedroom of the Schlegel Milk House. Uh, this comes with an old fashioned version of an ensuite. Here in the corner, there is a chamber pot for nighttime bathroom business. Chamber pots often had cozies to help prevent the noise from spreading throughout the house. This bedroom is perfect for a young couple starting a family. There's space for a rocking chair to lull your baby back to sleep. The side room has space for a cradle to have your baby sleeping overnight in the same room. Um, on the stressor, there are some more clues as to what life might have been like in the early 1900s. There is a blue box meant to hold all the clean collars. Laundering was really hard during that time. Keeping things white was a challenge. They'd replace the collar before replacing the shirt to keep it nice and clean. These long handled hooks are button hooks to close and fasten buttons as easily as possible on clothes and shoes. This is a hat pin holder, a necessary accessory for fashionable women. There were many women that lived in this house. On the right side, there is a hair curler and a hair receiver. Uh, this celluloid box would keep the hair that you've brushed out of your head. Um, they would use that hair to add to their buns, to put in pin cushions, and sometimes even to make art or jewelry, which is very interesting. Um, and finally, we have a bathtub. So this bathtub has a big water container, a big metal water container with a gas line and a heating unit to make a nice private warm bath in your bedroom. Um, when it's completely upright, it looks just like a wooden cupboard, um, but it then folds down to be your private bath. Thank you for visiting the master bedroom of the Schlegelmock house.